Hi guys, today I'm going to make you some crispy sweet potato fries. They're baked in the oven so you can avoid the fat of deep frying. These are sweet potatoes. I'm using four medium sized sweet potatoes. We'll wash them, peel them and cut them. First preheat your oven to 425 degrees. A white peeler is great for this job. Now we'll cut them up. Cut the ends off. Any little blemishes. This is a long sweet potato, so I'm gonna cut this in half. And cut this into strips. This is a good size, about half an inch. Try to cut them all about the same length and thickness. Cut up all my potatoes. To my sweet potatoes, I'll add a little bit of olive oil, about a teaspoon. You don't want to add too much oil at first. You can add a little bit more later as you need it. Sprinkling of cayenne pepper a half a teaspoon garlic powder, a quarter teaspoon of cumin powder, and about a quarter teaspoon of ground cinnamon. I'll also add a teaspoon of salt. Mix this together. I'll use my hands. You can see just the teaspoon of oil we use is enough for the spices to stick to the sweet potatoes. To get the sweet potatoes crispy, I'm gonna add a little bit of cornstarch. I like to just use my tea strainer, put a little bit of cornstarch in here. Just sprinkle it over, toss it, sprinkle. Just want to get all of them evenly coated. I'll add a tiny bit more oil, maybe about half a teaspoon, and give it another toss. cornstarch and the spices are sticking to the sweet potatoes, which is what we want. Okay, that looks good. I've got my baking sheet. I'm gonna pour a teaspoon of oil on the sheet and just spread it with my fingers. Spread it all around. Now I'm gonna put the sweet potatoes down on the sheet in a single layer. They should not be touching each other because you want them to crisp up and not steam. You might need two trays for this. I love these half sheet trays because they're so useful in the kitchen. You could use them to bake just about anything. Meats, vegetables, fruit, whatever you'd like. These are gonna go in the 425 degree oven for about 15 to 20 minutes. I'll check on them and turn them over. Try this recipe and tell me what you think. 
don't forget to subscribe and I'll see you next time.